Hello everybody and welcome back to Advanced Maths. Today I'm going to talk to you about how to ace your exams. I've got five tips, revise, practice, focus, use your time wisely and compete. Let's talk about this, shall we? First one is revise. This is obvious, of course, and you should revise very thoroughly. Plan your revision. So put the time in to make sure you are focused and your revision is effective. Regular revision over months is so much more effective than crammed revision the day before the exam. This will give you a lot of confidence to walk into the exam knowing that you are fully prepared and that will help a lot with things like exam anxiety and also just make, uh, make you proud of the fact that you are putting your heart into that exam. Practice. This does make perfect and you will become smoother and more fluent with practice. However, you must be careful. You must be sure that you are doing uh, your practice correctly. So you need to regularly mark and check your answers. Practice makes permanent as well as perfect. So anything you practice will be what you remember. So you need to be sure you are doing it correctly so you're not making uh, practicing doing the wrong thing because that's only going to damage your revision. So that's why I say mark and check your answers. Use a mark scheme or even ask your teacher to mark some of your questions that you've practiced. This will again lower your exam anxiety in exam conditions and you will be uh, more ready for each exam question and confident that you are well practiced. And if you practice enough, you'll get to the point where you'll be so used to every exam style question possible that you won't be too surprised or too caught off guard in the moment of the exam. And again, that will really help your confidence to answer that question. Focus. You need to keep your eye on the prize. So when I am uh, preparing something, I remember about why this is important to me. And the truth is that this exam will impact your future. And a lot of the exams will really, really affect your future career, your chances at university, or whatever your dreams you have. And that is true. That Your future employer will look back at your exams uh, for every subject, and this will help their decision on whether to employ you or not, no matter what your dreams are. And so you need to be switched on and in the zone. That means that you need to be on your absolute best performance uh, to really achieve your full potential in that exam. Go get it. Work hard. This is your dream. Go seize that moment. Use your time wisely. So revision and practice should be organised and focused, as I said before. Every second of exam preparation and in the exam should be spent really effectively. Read the question properly. You'll be amazed how many marks are lost uh, from misunderstanding the question. Highlight the question if you need to or underline keywords so you don't miss any details. Check your answers as you go so you should be habitually checking everything you write down to make sure that you're not making any silly mistakes. Do not stop until the examiner tells you to put the pen down. You should be take this exam incredibly seriously. Don't relax halfway through the exam. Keep going. Keep working hard. And again, check your answers and add detail or clarity if needed. So the last 10 minutes of the exam should be spent checking your answers if you have time. Again, do not relax. The people who score the very best marks in the exam work right up until the last second. And then finally, compete. Remember that you are actively competing against every other student in the world who is sitting that exam. If they get higher marks than you, they will drag the exam grade boundaries up. So it'll be harder for you to score the grade you want. So you are really, really are competing with them. Change your mindset to be competitive like sports people. Imagine you are in a football game or a netball game or a marathon. You are competing against everyone else. And that should hopefully make your mindset more focused and more um, principled to really achieve your full potential. And push yourself, as I say, push yourself like a marathon athlete to work every single second at your absolute best, knowing how rewarding this can be.
Imagine yourself at the graduation ceremony or on results day, really, really being proud of yourself for putting your heart into these exams and achieving your very, very, very best. Okay, so they are my top tips. Revise, practice, focus, use your time wisely and compete. I really hope that helps and I really wish you the best of luck in your exams. Advanced Maths has some uh, useful resources that you might like. We have a revision guides for all of GCSE Maths if you're studying maths and we also have past paper questions available on the website. I will link them in the description below. I also have some more revisio videos on revision uh, tips to help you. If you like this video, a like and a subscribe will really help the channel and recommend this to your friends and classmates. Thanks for watching guys and good luck in your exams.